it's an exciting day. We're actually getting the basement floor poured. So, Kat, you can get up here closer. How many truckloads will you need? So they're gonna do two truckloads, this is the first one. We've got a beautiful day here in May. Uh, the roof has been installed. We've got a TPO roof above there, um, some electric. I'm gonna go over here, we're gonna get out of the noise. What we're doing is we're waiting for just the right uh, shade of brick so we can look at this neighboring house here. We were trying to match this so that building really looks like it's been here all these years. So to get just that right brick, we had to wait for a batch to be made in June. So it's today is what, May 15th? So we've got a month before that arrives. So in the meantime, we'll be ordering windows. Uh, this, this floor is going in, plumbing, electrical. So a lot of things that we're gonna do in the meantime to, to get going. Jay is getting ready for the concrete pour here. So as long as we've got the truck up, they're gonna pour a concrete slab here. And uh, so he's, he's just getting ready. Uh, have we already put the rebar in there yet, Jay? So the second truck will make sure they got plenty there first. Got it. They're got it. Short down there. But you can see this board here. Jay's put that there, so in, that'll be the edge of the concrete pour. Beyond that, we're actually going to have what a limestone step. So again, to make it look old school. So, all right. You think it'd be uh, are we okay to get down there in that basement? Yeah. So we're down here in the basement. Yeah, it's a big basement, nice tall ceilings. We don't have any bearing walls or columns coming down, so it's clear span. You can see we made a decision late in the project to actually rough in plumbing for the basement, so a fourth bedroom could be added down here. Um, you can see the, the sump pit is here, and also the grinder pit for the plumbing. But then we can walk over here. Kind of exciting to see the floor being poured in action here. And other things to note down here, we'll have the staircase. Once the floor gets poured, the carpenters will come back and build the staircase that'll actually come down this way. Um, and we made, uh, oh, and then back here, we've got the egress. So that's our emergency egress to get out of the basement. Anyway, that's it from 1959 uh, Lynch Street for Colleen Studio Architects. I'm Mike Colleen. Peace out. Thank you.